Today we will learn how we can add Python to path variables in Windows so we can run Python commands from command line. But first of all, let's make sure that it is not running right now. So we are not able to use Python from command line right now. So if I run this, as you can see, it is giving me this error. Python was not found. Run without arguments to install from Microsoft Store. Okay, in previous Windows version, uh, it would just show command was not recognized or something like that. So anyway, the solution is the same. So what you need to do is, first of all, you need to figure out where your Python is. All right, so if I type Python here, as you can see, this is already installed, but I cannot run it from command line. So what you can do is open the file location, <coughs> excuse me, and if it directly opens your uh, Python installation direct, uh, folder, you, you will just need to copy that path. But in this case, as you can see, there's a shortcut icon here. Uh, let me make this extra large icon, this shortcut icon here. So it means that it is just a shortcut, not actually where it is installed. So I'll right click again, right click again, and open find location again. And this is where my path is installed. I mean, my Python is installed. So I'll copy this. Again, click open your start. Uh, what is it called? Start menu, and type environment. As you can see, it's already here. You just open it, and click this environment variables. Okay, so I'm already in advanced. If you are here or somewhere here, you will have to go to advanced and then click on environment variables. And so there are two kinds of variables. One is user variables for this currently logged in user and there are system variables. So if I add that path to this one, it will only be applicable to this user. But if I add it here, it will be applicable, it will be available to all the users. So let's add it to system variables and click on edit and click on new and you paste the path here all right i've pasted it here and click ok click ok again okay where did it go click ok and now it is ready so we should be able to run this now run the command now but uh, we are facing the same error so in some cases you might have to restart your pc or in some cases you just need to close this terminal uh, reopen this terminal and let's see if this works this way yes as you can see now it is running right now so yeah if you have any problems let me know in the comment section below if this helped you please subscribe and like it will mean a lot to me thank you very much